it's Melvin here, tackling allegations again today. I wrote down all the steps for you here. I also have all the steps in the description box under this video. Okay, let me paint the scenario for you guys, right? We need to make dextrose 17.5%. And we have dextrose 50% vials, and we have dextrose 10% bags. And the amount that we need to make is 500 ml. How do we do that, right? Okay. So the steps here say, write what you need in the middle. So that would be the 17.5%. Write what you have on the left with the high number on top. So that would be the dextrose 50% vials and then the dextrose 10% under that, the bags. Okay, step three, cross subtract. Step four, add the parts from the cross subtraction. Step five, divide the amount needed by the total parts. Step six, multiply each part by the answer of the division. All right, so let me show you guys here how to do that. Okay, so we need the 17.5%, we have the 50%, and we have the 10%, and the amount is 500 mils. Those are the only four bits of information you need to solve this problem. Don't worry about anything else. All right, so the first step here, we're going to write what we need in the middle. So we need 17.5%. So let me do that right here 17.5%. That's what we need, right? And then the second step, write what you have on the left with the high number on top. So that would be the 50% on top, right? The 10% on the bottom, okay? The third step, cross subtract. So we're gonna do 50 minus 17.5 is 32.5. All right, and then the 10 minus the 17.5, it's gonna leave us 7.5, right? Okay, so we cross subtracted. Now it says step four, add the parts from the cross subtraction. Okay, so the 7.5 plus 32.5 is 40. I'm gonna write 40 right here, okay. Then the next step is divide the amount needed by the total parts. So the amount needed, we need 500 mLs, right? So let's make some space here. So the 500 mLs divided by the total parts, okay? So 500 divided by 40 is 12.5. Okay. So what's the next step? It says multiply each part by the answer of the division. So these are the parts right here, right? 7.5 and 32.5. So we got to multiply that by 12.5. Okay. Multiply that. 12.5, all right, let's see. So the 7.5 times 12.5 equals 93.75, okay. And then the 32.5 times 12.5 equals 406, 406.25. All right. Okay, so what does that mean? The 93.75, that's mLs, right? So that's telling you that you're going to need, from dextrose 50% vials, you're going to need 93.75 mLs of that. Okay, and then with the 406.25, that means you're going to need dextrose 10% 406.25 to equal a total volume of 500 mLs. Okay, of the 17.5%. And that's it. That's how you solve this problem. So I'm going to walk you guys through what I did one more time. Okay, the first step was write what you need in the middle. So I wrote the 
okay? Write what you have on the left with the high number on top. So the deck shows 50% and the deck shows 10%. Step three, cross subtract. So 50 minus 17.5 is 32.5, okay? And 10 minus 17.5, or you could say 17.5 minus 10 is 7.5. You're not gonna work with any negatives, it's just the 7.5, right? And then the next step is add the parts from the cross subtraction. So these are the parts, right? So the total amount of parts is 40, all right? And then the next step, divide the amount needed by the total parts. So then this is the amount needed up here, 500 mils. You gotta divide that by 40, that gives you 12.5. And then step six, multiply each part by the answer of the division. So this is each part, right? Multiply by 12.5. And then that gives you the amount of mLs you need for each drug to make 17.5% of 500 mLs. All right, I hope you guys got that. I hope you understood that. Sorry, I'm super tired. I just ended my long shift and my long week, all right? Thanks. Like, subscribe. Please subscribe, guys. It only takes you one second to subscribe, and it really helps me out. I appreciate it. Thanks. P.S. I know I forgot to put the emails here initially and over here, but I'm not going to do this whole video over again. Thank you guys for watching. Washing. Wow, you know I'm tired. I truly appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. I see